Hey guys, so everybody is doing a giveaway for Reborns and everything, so I'm going to jump on the bandwagon. Hee <laughs> hee. Um, <laughs> so the thing I'm doing is a Reborn um, giveaway. Um, and the Reborn I'm giving away is one of the dolls that I have up for sale. Um, so the... The giveaway is, the rules, you must be 18 or older to enter. Um, if you're not 18, if you're under 18, you must have a parent's permission um, to enter the contest. Um, you must have an active uh, YouTube Reborn account. And by active, um, you must have videos up or you must have commented on certain videos in the past six months. Um, or in the past month, actually. Um, and you can enter the contest one of two ways. You can make a video response, or you can comment on my video or inbox me through Google Plus and tell me, um, what this means, what the nativity means to you. Okay, so, getting to the contest. I am into the Christmas season this year, and it's just wonderful. I love it. Um, and for those of you that don't know, I do follow St. Michael the Archangel, and I love nativities. I love seeing people set them up, whether you're poor or rich. I love seeing your nativities set up. I think that's something everybody can relate to, whether you're pagan or Christian or Catholic or Jewish or whatever. I think that's just something everybody can relate to. Um, and, um, if you have a nativity... You know, obviously, but to make it more reborn-ish, okay, um, if you have human reborns or alternative reborns, um, you can do this, although I'd prefer you do it with the human reborns, <laughs> um, but you can do it with the alternative reborns, um, that might get a little bit uproar, but if you want to do it with your alternative reborns, you can make the video private, and you can PM it to me. PM me the link, and I'll watch it. Um, anybody can enter. It's the Christmas season, so anybody can enter. Um, it's going to run to January 27th um, through the 27th of January. I will pick an um. I will pick a person on the 27th of January. Um, so actually going to run through the 28th of January. So the 28th, I will pick a winner, and uh, I'll send out their reborn, which is going to be well after Christmas. So, okay. So, if you guys have toddlers, or um, if you have toddlers, I want you to make a nativity out of your reborn. Um, I just think it would be a good thing to see everybody's reborns. Um, so if you have a toddler girl and a toddler boy, dress them up as somebody from the nativity. It can be Mary, Joseph, uh, the three wise kings, um, uh, the shepherds, the shepherd boy. It can be anybody. And obviously you would need one to represent the baby Jesus. Um, now this is just a giveaway. It's just... I'm feeling joyous, I'm feeling the holiday season, and I really want somebody to be able to enjoy having a reborn that otherwise couldn't afford to get it. So, um, this is just a little, you know, no rude comments, no nothing, but, um, but get creative. Make a nativity scene out of your reborns, um. Yeah, Elia's like, I'm not ready to go to sleep. <laughs> Sorry, guys, I'm getting carried away. Um, make a nativity out of your reborns. Um, now, another option is, however, if you do not have a toddler reborn yet, or if you're expecting one sometime in the near future, and you know it's not going to be here in time for Christmas, that's fine. Um, make a video of your reborn of one of your favorite Reborns, i.e. mine's Alea, um, and just tell me what the nativity means to you. 
obviously, since I don't have a toddler, um, I'm just going to tell you guys. This is my contest entry. Um, so, what the nativity means to me is that it's, it's a significant, it signifies hope to me. It signifies hope. It signifies that in your darkest needs, someone is going to come forth and light your way. Um, that's what it means to me. It's something that has, you know, obviously I grew up in a Roman Catholic, uh, family, so I am pagan. Um, so to me, the nativity is something that has always been centered around in our family. Um, and to me, the nativity is a time of family, you know, when Mary went into labor with the baby Jesus, nobody had room for her. And, uh, finally, somebody said, there's room in my manger. And that small gesture of hope, she was able to give birth in a nice, peaceful, quiet place. Granted, it was filled with animals, but other than that, it was a, a peaceful, quiet place. Um, and it was just her and her husband, Joseph. And, um... To me, the nativity represents family. You know, no matter what happens, family is always going to be there to brace your fall. Um, so that's just what the nativity means to me. And this is my contest entry for the Reborn giveaway. Um, so like I said, if you have toddlers, um, dress them up. Pose them, you know. Uh, make them look like they're acting out a school play, like a, a play nativity scene or, you know, or something. Um, set them up in your room in their nursery, you know. Um, and if you're doing it with an alternative reborn, you don't want everybody to see it, you can PM me. Um, the winner will be chosen on January 28th. Um, and it will be a reborn that I am giving away. Um, baby Michael, he will be the reborn. Um... That I'm giving away. He is textured. Uh, he has a preemie skin tone. And he is textured like a real preemie. Um, either that or I could just make an alternative reborn for one of you guys. If you don't. If any of you for whatever reason decide you don't want him. Um, and you would like a alternative baby like this. I am willing to go out and buy a Behringer. And... Uh, make the Behringer for you, but I just would have to charge extra for the body. Um, but, or you have the option of me making baby Michael into an alternative reborn. Um, so, that is my Christmas giveaway. Bye guys.